I've been working here since night. I was hired in 1980. And I went to work in 1981. Okay. And re refurbishing, redoing the dance department that was here. And I suggested to the president at that time that there was no real place for dancing musical theater uh, students to get a good, strong liberal arts education and learn how to sing, dance, and act. So President Walker said, can you do that? I told him, absolutely, I'm sure I know I can do this. And I had my fingers crossed in the back. So I wasn't so sure, but I think if you're gonna do great things, sometimes you just have to jump in and you have to believe in yourself and do it. Step on one, walk it out. From the top, I'm gonna to face this way. Hold one, two, three, four, walk, five, six, pivot, go. In only one week, to set six numbers, five numbers, or four numbers, depending on what block you're in. I've always loved music theater, and I've always loved music theater performers. And I felt that there were such wonderful ballet modern schools here in America in the 80s that uh, it was a shame we didn't have a place where people could go and study tap, jazz, ballet, singing, acting, uh, how to read a contract, how to uh, be safe and uh, successful in New York or LA or Chicago. They're all different. We taught, um, I taught a class about survival in the business, real pragmatic survival and anatomy so that you know how your body functions. And those were things that um, were not universally taught at that time. It's that I actually did create a department within four years. We had um, 100 students and then we went to 200 and capped it off. You have to have enough teachers and time to give really quality teaching. Dance is a strange art. Um, some arts are just time or space, like painting is space. You can go back to the cave uh, dwellers and see that space. Music is time but dance is time and space. So uh, we've kind of capped it around 200 people here, and we went from performance to uh, another major, which was arts <coughs> management, and we went to another major then, which is uh, pedagogy. We are very successful in teaching Rockettes. We're very successful in having people on Broadway. I think we've been in 84 shows so far, Broadway shows. Uh, we also have many people who are on tour and in, on cruise ships or working in Vegas or uh, LA and Chicago and places like Branson in between. But they go from one job to another. And often if somebody is, feels like they've uh, had an, they feel like they don't want to perform anymore. They can easily go into management or to go and uh, form their own school. So we have successful schools and people working uh, in many forms of education. So I'm happy about all that. Oh, Frosty, I want to warn you, you are in a Frosty suit. So if you're doing your time steps, you know, like all aboard for Broadway, I think, I'm just letting you know, once you get in that suit, you're pretty much Frosty. Yeah, yeah, and you can do this, but I don't To think that people see the product of all that work that they don't see is really touching. That's meaning, it's really wonderful. So I'm grateful to all the citizens of Oklahoma. <laughs> Thank you for coming to the shows and seeing what we're doing here.